with LSU it's absolutely amazing just to see um, the power of volunteers and how it is actually working and that volunteers don't need to come over with a massive corporate company nor do they have to come over with an idea of what they want to do they can kind of come over, get a feel for everything, make a project up themselves, spend their own fundraise money um, and basically enable themselves to have a really really good time um, we've had some great volunteers this year um, and I'm so excited for next year I've been involved in lots of volunteer projects but LSU are honestly doing this right. They're one of the few organisations that are really dedicated to what they're doing. Um, and they really know what they're doing, they've built relationships with the people there for several years now. Um, and they really talk with the people and they ask them what they want and they don't just throw the money into something that's not going to benefit um, them in the future. It'll be something that's sustainable and can keep going, it's really organised, it's well structured. And another thing is great that they know the country so well and they have so many friends around the country that um, you'll feel really safe. And not just that, you'll get a lot out of um, learning about the culture. Um, and this makes the experience really personal, it did for me, because I learned so much about how people live in um, Africa, in a place like Malawi. There was lots of poverty and you can really learn a lot about that and also you can make friends, you'll be friends with the life. I found to learn with uh, direction in search of the community development work that I should do and offer myself after I heard about Tilan, the potential work that they were doing. And uh, I was so excited to come as part of the community to offer what our best part. From the look of things, we have seen it, we feel it, and uh, there is a hope that there is a big future for Tilanu and LSU about what they are doing both in the city by helping Tilanu and also in the village where in the remote areas it is hard for the people like the elderly people who cannot really help themselves they need support and also the young ones who are orphans they need much support Though there are some other ups and downs that time after time we need to tackle them and there are some stages that we are really willing to reach but still we are on the way and everything is showing progress. It was an incredible feeling to see all the community getting involved and see the difference that just a small amount of money in sort of our English terms can make to such a huge amount of people's lives. Um, just through 11 days worth of volunteering and five, six hundred pounds, you've changed the lives of four or five hundred children and the actual community themselves. It's an incredible feeling that, to be honest with you, nothing else compares to. It might seem like a huge task, but we do all have it in us to change the world and love support unite and help give the directions to that in little ways. And we can start from our way. Thank you, God bless you, everyone in UK who helps Tinan.